morning. It's Mark Parrish. Uh, I haven't done this for a while, so it's uh, spring. Uh, the leaves are coming out, and uh, I've been really busy lately with uh, getting homes ready, and homes have been selling pretty quickly. But what I'm doing this morning is something a little different. Um, I've been fortunate to be on Fox 9 News a couple times, and they've asked me to come out and do kind of a three-part series. One about spring market, how are homes selling in the Twin Cities, um, two, about staging, uh, things that sellers could be doing to get their homes ready for market. And then three, kind of a different thing, we're going to be doing a Facebook Live question and answer with uh, their viewers. So, kind of exciting, and I'm just trying to drive without getting uh, run over or hitting over a mailman, but uh, we'll see you at the house. So we'll do that, that'll be our first segment, and we'll kind of, like, depending on once we get into the house and we see the layout, um, we'll see, you know, how much we can do kind of almost as live sure. or if we need to be really segmented which is fine if we need to because it's edited obviously um, and then the second one will be the staging okay and that will be like totally a start over kind of fresh as if it's another okay. you know another segment which it will be so perfect right. do you want to do the backyard too because we can get through the gate um, if that well I want to show the side oh yeah great I do so, too yeah <laughs> pop up in your neighborhood or all across the metro. Yeah, it's a hot, hot market specifically for sellers. So what should you do if you want to sell or maybe you're looking to buy a house? Let's get some advice from the experts. Sure. sure people would love that. Yeah. The new buyers, I'm sure, would love that. So I'm in the house. It's a... Uh with Kelly O'Connell from Fox 9 News. Hi. And we're doing kind of a two-part series today just talking about staging and then what sellers can be doing for the biggest bang for the buck. And we've just been kind of walking through the house talking about kitchens, bathrooms, light fixtures, flooring, and the next segment we're gonna talk more about, you know, staging and how staging is different than renovating. And just, again, what buyers and sellers expect, what sellers should be doing, Cost, just good staging, bad staging, all that kind of stuff. Do flowers actually make a difference? That's my question. <laughs> <laughs> you you know, know, it's a smaller kitchen. What they did to you know get, add value is they open up the wall, they put a door in. So I mean, it's just more access, and, and and so it feels bigger. But you know, the trends today are definitely white subway tile, white drawers. Um, you don't have to do that, but I'm not, I wouldn't point that, out, point that out. But countertops, marble, light white. Light, white, and bright. That's perfect. That's exactly. And then the staging stuff would be more like the yeah, flowers and the lemons, lemons and the, and the yeah. furniture. And yeah, that's perfect. So what we'll do is we'll be inside and say, and I'll, I'll we'll come in and say, we're specifically in this house because these sellers did it right. Because kind of the concept is like, okay, so what's worth it? You know what I mean? And You'll ask me questions, I'll just... Yeah, okay. go with it, you know. You know how to do it. We're at this house in South Minneapolis because the owners, previous owners who just sold it, really did things right. They did what it counts to, you know, get most bang for your bar. Mark Parrish is here telling us. Buyers out there. So, what makes your 
how stand out. Do the flowers, does a bowl of lemons actually work? Because it gives you more money if you're putting your house on the market. Mark Paris says, yes, that's why I'm holding lemons. Lemons right. and limes are key. Yeah. I'm just kidding. Yeah. Beyond the lemons and limes that are in the kitchen. Uh, you talk about staging versus renovating. Right. Two very different things. Thanks for tuning in. Hopefully we'll get some more of these going here in the next couple weeks.